All right, guys. It's Wednesday, 2.54 a.m. Almost time for Chapter 18 of Mando. Let's go. All right, guys. So we are back with another reaction video. Mandalorian Chapter 18. So should... Oh, it just dropped. So Chapter 18 is 45 minutes long. It doesn't even have a title, which is strange. I think it's called The Minds of Mandalore. So let's get into the reaction. Mos Eisley? Ah, Pelimoto! Oh, is BD1 still there around? Yes! BD! Let's go! Pit droids? I love the BD1 droid. You know, I just don't sit around here and work all day. I'm very popular. R5. Mendo! Sorry. Well, uh, where's my guy? Oh, okay. All five. You're supposed to be piloting starfighters across the galaxy and fighting tyranny. Oh, that's why there was the fireworks in the trailer. Hey, the boom to E. The minds of Mandalore. Let's go. We're going to Mandalore, baby. Let's go. I didn't think we would get to see Mandalore this quick. Mm -hmm. Looks like he's flying into Camino. Wow. He looks real crispy right there. Oh, she gave him an oil bath. Don't be a baby. Mm. Just get the samples we need. Oh, shit. Oh, damn. The dark saber. Let's go. Yes. Come on, Mando. Got him. Let's go, baby. He still can't wheel that thing, though. Come on, Din. That was sick. Smooth. I wonder what's going to be down there. Oh, isn't this the part in the trailer where he finds that helmet in the sand? That's su Yes! That super throwback one. Hey, that's Precious Best Car there, eh? Oh, what the heck? Yo, what is that? Oh, look at all those helmets. Yo, my guy. He's being brave to go save Mando. That's so funny. He's investigating the, the what's going on. Oh, the dark saber. No. Yo, he looks so funny creeping around in the background. Oh, he's learning to walk a little quicker. <laughs> that little run. Use the force. Yes, you got it. You got it. You got it. Oh. Yo, he's out. Oh, here's the part from the trailer. Boom. Yes. Yo. <laughs> Damn, so he leaves Din there. 
Why are you Maybe so... I didn't make myself clear the last time. <laughs> what happened to him? Oh, her ship is so dope. Oh. Flashback? No. Flashback? My family ruled it all. Flashback with the teen? Now it's a tomb. Oh, no flashback. Come on. Oh, please tell me she picks up the dark saber and kills that creature with the saber. Oh, please. It's just sitting on the floor. I knew quite a few Jedi, you know. I don't know what they taught you about us, but there was a time we actually got along quite well. Fought side by side. The clone was. How good are you with the Force? You must be quite good at it if you got back to me all alone. Damn. Yes. Oh, sh I called it. I freaking called it. Yo, look how... Look how good she wields it, though. Mando couldn't even hold it up. Oh, he's not dead. Behind you. Yo. Wow, so sick. I knew it. I knew it. She was going to get the dark saber. Just keep it. What happened? I saved your life. Give us a flashback, please. The Empire set out to punish us. To wipe away our memory. Oh, I thought she was going to name drop Satine. Ah! That I shall walk the way of the Mandalore. And the words of the creed in my heart. Oh, bro, she's saving him again. Uh oh, a mythosaur. <laughs> oh, shit. We just saw a live-action mythosaur? Yo! Oh, it's gonna end right there. Damn! Wow, okay. All right, so that is uh, chapter 18. So my thoughts on this first episode... Wow, I mean, so my thoughts on this second episode of season three, it was pretty dope. It was, uh, at first, I'm like, oh, this whole episode is going to just take place here. We're not going to get nothing more. But it was cool just seeing bo save the day twice. It was, I, I'm glad we got to see the Darksaber again. But, like, man, Dan, like, what have you been doing, bro? Like, practice, train, like, figure it out. Like, you got the freaking Darksaber. So he could barely still wield it. And I called it when I saw Bo flying down that she's going to pick up that saber and use it. And I was right. And, like, you saw how smooth she was with it and how she wielded it with no problem. Like, it's so clear that it belongs with her. Like, it belongs with her. She's going to get it 100% during the season. Like, some, like, for sure. And then when Din was walking in the waters and he kind of, did he just fall into, like, a hole and, like, just sink because his armor is so heavy? I thought like a creature or something like took him and pulled him down. My man just fell in the pool. <laughs> like, really? bo jumps in, saves the day again. And then it was just sick when she was coming up. She saw that eyeball move and you could clearly see the freaking mythosaur. So I know that was kind of like leaks and rumors before the, sh the, sh the season came out. 
that there's going to be a mythosaur in it and maybe even somebody riding it. Like, it's going to happen. I don't know when. I don't know if it's going to be next episode or I don't know. But, man, it ended, like, on that cliffhanger kind of. So I cannot wait for next week just to kind of see what why Din fell, if maybe he doesn't know how to swim, and just to see Bo-Katan talk about the mythosaur and maybe, like, she'll tell Din that she saw it and maybe he doesn't believe her that, oh, it's a myth, they don't exist or they're extinct or something like that. But, man, that was pretty crazy. Now, I already know Funko is going to drop a bo pop wielding the Darksaber. I, it's coming. I'm calling it right now. That Funko is coming. Maybe even some more vintage or Black Series figures, bo with the Darksaber. So, so that's pretty much my reaction to this episode. I give it... That's a solid 8. I give it... Well... Yeah, I give it a solid eight, maybe seven and a half. But seeing that Mythosaur and Bo wield the dark saber and get a little bit more like the Mandalore history, lore, and backstory, I, I'll give it an eight. I swear, at like three or four times when she was talking about how it used to be so beautiful here, I thought she we were gonna see a flashback of live action Mandalore like in its prime, like from the Clone Wars days. That I feel like that was a missed opportunity. Like, come on, give us like five seconds of live action Mandalore. And then when she was talking about her royal family and her father, I thought she was going to name drop Satine. Like, I just wanted a live action name drop of Satine. Kenobi's boo. Oh, that would have been so cool. But there's still a chance, though. We still got six more episodes. So definitely, uh, definitely a solid episode. I think I enjoyed this one more than the first one. But we got a lot more stuff in the first one. Not as much in this because it was all in the cave. But no, I still I think I enjoy this one more. So let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. And that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys enjoy this video, drop a like. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you.